between haystacks up there. Yeah. And seat up that way. And we're now going between the two. She hates me staying out all night. So okay, I'm so up a dead ahead of us there is the path you can see in the distance is Windy Gap with Green Gable to the left, Great Gable to the right. The bar. Hey, oh, hey, perfect. Now you hope I die. The bikers are here. They've just managed to climb up that uh, that rock face with the bikes on the backs. Three, three cyclists there carrying the bikes up. Must be mad. Must be mad. This is where we turn right. Ten to twelve. And we're just about to. Make the final ascent up to Pillar. So we're well on our way now up to Pillar. That pillar up there is 891 metres. Behind us there, that is Kirk Bell Crags. Whoops! Probably the tip there. Yeah. Well, that's you, Barrow, there. On the right, from West Water around the corner. Cloud's coming down now, isn't it? Over there. Yeah. Oh, Keep. Bob. I wonder if the mic's going to pick that up. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> Final climb up to Pillar. It's not going to take us long. It's 12 30 at the moment. And then we'll look up to the top of the pillar. <laughs> and then we just have to go down again. Another one. Okay. Yes, another one. Another <laughs> way in right ticked off. Oh my god, we're still not there. Looks like the cloud has completely <laughs> enclosed us. What about up here and round this side here? Is this any uh, better? Uh, maybe not. Holy Jesus. Yeah, I don't, oh, think we'll, I don't think we'll go around this way. Oh, yeah. Draggy rock. We do no wind. Here we go. Here we are at Pillar. Here we are, another one, Conkers. Yeah. Okay, yeah. so that's taken us half nine, half ten, half ten, half twelve, three and a half hours. Three and a half hours together, yeah. Three and a half hours. Yep. Yeah. Oh, I can't see the other one. It's now two o'clock. We're probably about halfway. No pressure, Bob. No pressure. No pressure. Turning into a chem there. <laughs> bring, bring it on, bring it on trees. Right. How, how far down is it? How far down is it? Oh, oh there's, there's the road as well. Okay. Oh yeah. Easy. Oh, 
<laughs> oh. Dream was just at the side of the path. Hey. But uh, it's, a, it's about 100 foot down below. Okay. It's a ravine. It's a long way down, isn't it? Yeah. So we're now on our alternative uh, alternative route back. We decided not to pursue the idea of the the gentle river path because it's not very gentle. So we decided to go with the boring old forest track instead because we know where it's going to take us. So here we are, we've, we've made another decision to avoid a ridiculous footpath, a non-existent footpath through the woods. Yeah. Through 10 to 4, we're looking to be getting back at the hotel probably half 5, quarter 6 I think. So here we are. We're at the point at which we've got to go back up. Yep. This is our the last climb of the day. It's going to take us back up to the gap uh, at the bottom of seat. And then we're going to go through that and then all the way down back to the car park. So we're going to just start this climb now and have the last climb of the day. Now we're on our way down. To the car park. Yeah, it's just gone half past four. We think it should take us about 45 minutes to get down. So, I mean, legs are dropping off. Bob's legs are dropping off. And we realised we had a very lucky escape by making the decision that we yeah. made <laughs> half an hour ago and going the way that we went rather than going the way that we should have gone, which was a ridiculous route doesn't actually exist. Yep. Nearly there. Not far to go. Bob's legs are buckling. Should I just keep them in there? Sink like, you know, trying to... Don't let them go too far. They won't fall from underneath me. <laughs> <laughs> Oh. Have we had a good walk? Oh! Nearly wasn't though. Hey, put the jeeps on it there. <laughs> it's been long and hard. Okay, so this is what we're going to be doing tomorrow. Okay. Is that okay, Bob? Do that tomorrow. 50k mountain run. <laughs> oh my god. Here we go. We've finished. That's it. It's now about quarter past five. End of work. Back to the car. Over and out. A couple of pints, yeah. then a lovely tea, and then that's it. Oh, oh then the Eurovision. Oh, yes. Oh, yeah, the Eurovision Song Contest. Yay. <laughs> <laughs>